Hey everyone, Susie Phillips here and welcome back to this small account day trading challenge. I've been documenting my journey of growing a small trading account from just $500 using a focused day trading strategy. And today is Tuesday, November 12th, 2024 and we're in week four of this challenge. And today marks my 10th day trade in this exciting challenge. In today's video, I'll be recapping the details of how I grew my small account to nearly $40,000. That's an almost 8,000% growth from my initial balance. So let's get into today's trade recap and break down what went right and how I managed the setup and the key takeaways that you can use for trading. Let's dive into today's day trade. This morning, my account balance was at $15,345.88. And now, after today's trade, it has rocketed up to $39,624.73. So in less than one month, I've taken $500 and nearly turned it into $40,000. Not only is this incredible growth, but it also demonstrates the power of discipline, strategy, and patience when day trading with a small account. The goal of this challenge has been to show you that with the right tools and the right mindset, anyone can make significant gains even with a small initial balance. Today I traded a momentum stock called BTCT. This is a Chinese stock that popped up on my radar after I got an AI scanner alert at 5.59 a.m. my time. And again, I'm in the mountain time zone. These alerts are key because they notify me when a stock with high trading volume and rapid price movement appears. And that's perfect for day trading setups. During the pre-market, BTCT had gained around 65%, moving from about the $3 range to nearly $5. And that kind of momentum made it a prime candidate for a breakout play. Now here's where my analysis and trading tools come in. The first step that I took was to check the key indicators, volume, float, price range, and targets. BTCT had extremely high volume. It didn't have any specific news that I could see, and that's not uncommon with these Chinese stocks, but it had great potential based on its price action alone. My custom tools, including smart targets and support levels, gave me all the information that I needed to determine my entry and exit points way ahead of time. So here's how I approached the setup. I noted that the stock was in a tight channel during the early market, trading between $4.38 and $5.13. And both of these levels are smart target levels that my algo plots on my chart for me. And they're highly accurate. My trading algo actually plots all of these smart levels directly on my chart for me, making it super easy to see where the price is finding support and resistance and where it's going to go next. The EMA flattening is another important factor. They had flattened out right here. And that's a signal to wait for confirmation before jumping in. When the EMAs flatten, it means price action might go either way. So waiting for the breakout provides a clearer, safer entry. And I was looking for the breakout above this channel. So my plan was to enter the trade once price broke out of the $5.13 level with momentum. And that finally happened at around 7.57 a.m. Mountain Time. And so I bought in at $5.15 per share. Now with $15,345 capital available in my account, I was able to buy 2,979 shares at $5.15. Given that we had a triple EMA reclaim set up, I used the 50 EMA as my stop loss for this trade. My smart target tool displayed the key levels at $6.05, $9.90, $16.10, and a final target at around $17. Since this was a high momentum Chinese stock, I knew there was a strong chance it could push through multiple targets. So with momentum stocks like this, my strategy is to hold as long as the stock remains above the 50 EMA or until it reaches a major target. At around 8.30 a.m., after a few trade halts, I noticed this slight pullback here. Now, a critical reason that I decided to stay in the trade was the volume analysis. Selling volume was light compared to the buying volume here during this pullback. 
And that suggested that this pullback was likely just a temporary return to support and that trend would continue. So by 8.40 a.m., momentum surged again, pushing BTCT all the way to my $16.10 target. Now, I attempted to exit there. I tried to sell all of my shares there, but my order finally filled at $13.30 due to slippage. But even with that slippage, I made an impressive $24,278.85 profit in just one trade, taking my account to $39,624.73. So let's break down some key takeaways that you can apply in your own trading. Have a solid plan. Going into any trade without a plan can lead to emotional trading. Knowing my entry, my exit, and my stop loss points helped me stay on course. Even as BTCT experienced high volatility, a lot of trade halts, and some sideways action. Utilize volume and price action. Observing volume during pullbacks and comparing that to the buyer volume gave me the confidence to stay in the trade, anticipating further gains. Use smart target tools. Plot your targets automatically for you. Tools like my AI scanner and my smart target indicators help me identify key price levels. Streamlining my analysis so that I can focus on the trade itself. Stay patient and disciplined. Even when the price started stalling, staying disciplined and following my exit strategy based on the 50 EMA and the smart target levels allowed me to maximize my profit. Today's trade marks the end of my small account challenge because my account is no longer small. Taking my account from $500 to nearly $40,000 has been an incredible journey and I'm excited to explore new trading topics with you and share more strategies and help you grow as a day trader. For those of you who've been following my journey, I hope my experience has shown you that with patience, the right tools, and consistent practice, you can achieve substantial growth, even starting with a small balance. So thank you for joining me in this series. And if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for more trading tips and strategies. And I'll be posting an upcoming series here very soon. So drop a comment below if you have any questions about today's trade or share your experience trading with a small account. And if you're serious about learning to trade and want to take your trading skills to the next level, join my mentoring program at MomentumStockTraders.com. There we deep dive into setups, strategies, and tools that will help you reach your trading goals. Happy trading, everyone, and I'll see you in the next video.